logic board replacement. In replacing the logic board, you will want to take extra care to discharge any static electricity that you may be building up, and you also want to take special care and not to pop off any connectors or resistors on the logic board, as this is the most crucial piece in the Mac. To begin, you will want to get your flathead and your Torx T6 screwdriver. To begin, you will want to remove seven connectors from the logic board, located here, and the fan assembly. Remove the yellow tape. and the connection should snap off. The heat sensor right next to the fan assembly. the PRAM battery, the PCIe slot connector, the left fan assembly. First you will want to remove the tape. The heat sensor on the left upper part of the logic board. the heat sensor in the middle of the logic board. You will want to remove the yellow tape as well. Once you have removed the cables from the logic board, it's time to remove the screws. There are three 7.8 millimeter screws, two 7.6 millimeter screws, and seven 6.5 millimeter screws. All these are going to be Torx T6 screws. To begin, we were going to remove the three 7.8 millimeter screws from the logic board, which are located here in the bottom right hand corner of the logic board here in the upper right hand corner of the logic board and here midways in the bottom right hand corner of the logic board and the two 7.6 millimeter screws are located here in the battery connector and the seven 6.5 millimeter screws are located here here, 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 and here. Begin by removing these.
Once all the screws are removed, it's time to remove the logic board from the body. You will want to lift the logic board from the left hand side. There are two wires that are connected on the other side of the logic board. Once you lift up, you will see the wire, just simply disconnect. And the other wire is connected by the battery. This may not be removed in removing the logic board. Simply lift up and out to remove the logic board. 